What's up, video city? It's your girl, Bree, reporting live from Long Island, New York, back with the little show on Roku TV. We have so much in store for y'all today, but first, let's get into our interview with my girl, Tasha and Jody McCott. Video City, take it away. Hey, everybody, it's Tasha from Video City TV, and I'm here with Jody McKay. How are you? What's up, what's up? I'm great. How are you doing? I am doing well. How have you been holding up since the pandemic and all this craziness going on in the world? Um, I've been holding up pretty, pretty okay, you know, meditating, keeping myself together and focused on, you know, what I need to focus on. I'll be back. I've been doing well, you know, just staying inside. <laughs> nothing, nothing too exactly. special. Exactly. When you're leaving out, definitely wearing a mask. You know what I'm saying? Right. I think I've gone through at least four different masks. I've had to upgrade to the cloth mask because, you know, fashion statements here. <laughs> yeah, no, I understand. I, I ordered like the uh, the pack of the black mask from Amazon and mm-hmm. just go through them. Yeah. Have these yeah. times inspired any music for you? Yes, like I've really had like time to just like sit in the studio and really just like write, you know what I'm saying? Just really write out a bunch of stuff. Like I have so much stuff that's already recorded and done that I'm just, you know what I'm saying, easing it out, easing it out. So I have a bunch of video uh, videos that I'm like trying to get together too. So mm-hmm. really focusing on the visuals now. But yeah, this time it's just, I feel like for everybody, it's just, kind of force you to be creative in some type of way, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So where is it that you're from? I'm from New Orleans. Mm. Born and raised from New Orleans, Louisiana. And what is the music scene like out there? Uh, I mean, music scene is, is always, is always fire out here. You know what I'm saying? This city is filled with talent, filled with so much culture, you know what I'm saying? Like, everything. Music, food, you know, we know all that. So, it's, it's, it's always a vibe out here. And what are some things that inspire your music and creativity? Well, me personally, I'm, I'm, I find myself being most inspired by, uh, I would say mostly by New York rappers, actually. Mm. That type of vibe. I, I love the sound. Um, I'm always vibing. I find myself vibing to some type of some some music that's that's made by New York artists. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like that's definitely the vibe. But I'm inspired by Prince. I'm inspired by Michael Jackson. I'm inspired by Lenny Kravitz. Mm-hmm. You know, it's all Nicki Minaj, all that. Like Lil Wayne, of course. You know, from New Orleans, born and raised. So definitely the vibe for me. You know. Have you thought about making a move to New York or no, not yet? I did think about making a move to New York, but uh, I don't know. It just, it don't seem like it's the right time for me right now. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So especially how everything is going, just trying to stay safe and you know what I'm saying? Make sure my people good. So right now, probably not, but I did think about it. Cause yeah. I was actually in New York. Last time in New York was right before the pandemic so february that just passed so oh like wow the out there, yeah mm-hmm. so when we were leaving new york trying to come back you know back to new orleans they were saying like the airports is closing down so we kind of <laughs> wow you just made it <laughs> right just made it so you know and new york is always about i love new york so i really want to get into your video because I know you just talked about how the visuals are really important for you, especially something you've been focusing on during this pandemic. And I could tell, honestly, so I just want to know what inspired you behind it, behind the video, because it was just, I was blown away, honestly. Shit, that, that's love. <laughs> no problem. The video, mostly, like, if you see the video, it's a lot of different things. There's a lot of different um, elements in the video in terms of just, like, fashion and the clothes and stuff like that. But it kind of takes you through, like, this lucid dream almost type of vibe. Like, you have the scene with, uh, with the mannequins and uh, the, 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 the cases and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? But mostly for me, I wanted to incorporate a lot of my, like, my people in music videos. So you have, like, you have my best friend in the music video. You have my girlfriend in the music video, my brother, my sister, like my my partners, like you know what I'm saying, like my close my close knit people. Mm-hmm. And for me, it was important to have them and you know different scenes of it because it's kind of like, you know, as I'm popping my shit, I'm talking about like like permanent, like future things. You know what I'm saying? Like like this is how I see it. This is how it's gonna be. Like I see myself getting to a space where you know what I'm saying. Like I'm good and I'm able to make sure everybody around me good and. 
live out all the, the dreams that I got, you know? So mm -hmm. I wanted to pretty much have my friends and family along in that to kind of tell a story. Like, these are the people that's around me now, you know what I'm saying? And these are the people I perceive around me then, you know what I'm saying? Those right. So for each of the different sets and outfits and clothing, were you behind all that or did you have help? No, I styled, I, now one, one outfit was styled by uh, my best friend. So like, um, and if you, the very beginning of the video, there's like this, um, this green, um, like turtleneck and has like the patent leather, the girl she has a patent leather top and. Oh yeah. And, Right, mm -hmm. that was done by my best friend, like last minute on the spot. Like mm. there was so much, there was so much that happened, like to get the music video like together. Like I'm not kidding. Like my, my fucking car stopped. Oh, no. Set next, like mm -hmm. it was, it was all kind of shit. So, but style wise, I, I did all that. So like the the outfits you see, like on um, like my friends and stuff like that, I kind of gave them some type of direction of what I was looking for. Uh, like my girlfriend, my sister my brother, my cousins, like I styled them. So that's that's all me, you know? But I definitely had help from my best friend. Like she she was making sure like everything is like everything, you know? Mm -hmm. so, um, I really yeah. want to get into your delivery with your music. It's a unique style. It's not, it's like kind of aggressive, but it's still fun at the same time. So how did you come up with that? That's a, that's a good way to put it. That is a really good way to put it, actually. So I should use that to describe it. Um, <laughs> For me, I don't know. Like I said, I'm in, I'm inspired by New York rappers. And if you realize, like a lot of New York like rappers have that aggressive way of delivering, mm -hmm. you know, their lyrics. Right. Um, but I mean, you know, that's the way. I'm, and I'm from, you know, I'm from New Orleans. Like if you realize New Orleans rappers still, we have that, you know, what I'm saying that that aggressive way of delivery too. You know, what I'm saying it's very. Right cocky delivery vibe, you know what I'm saying? But I mean, I'm a fun person. I, I don't take myself too seriously, you know what I'm saying? So I guess that's probably why it's still kind fun. Of fun. Yeah. 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 It but looked I'm, like a fun I'm, video. It was, it was, it was fun making it. It was, it was dope to have like all the people around me that I actually vibe with, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like help me and support in a, in a, such a big way. So I, I appreciate all of them too. Um, and my last question is what type of message or what is the message you're trying to send out to people that are just now getting to know you? Uh, for me personally, um, I think it's really important to just be yourself mm -hmm. unapologetically. I know, you know, I know a lot of people say that, you know, <laughs> I, it, it's true. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that's really important. And what I'm just trying to convey is it, it's okay to be yourself. It's okay. It's important to be yourself because you were designed not by mistake. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Everything, everything has a purpose, and everything should be done with intention. So, if you're gonna do it, you gotta, you gotta do it right. You know right. What I'm saying? <laughs> right. And for me, for me personally, I can't. You know what I'm saying? I can't be nothing but myself. I can't mm -hmm. disappoint my creator. You know what I'm saying? So. Right. Hmm. That's, mm, that's nice. a <laughs> great response. Um, I know you talk about your support system a lot and it seems like they've helped you through out your entire career and it's really just the beginning for you. Would you like to shout out any of them? Yeah, so I, you know, I want to shout out my girlfriend, Bria. I want to shout out my best friend, Tiara. Uh, shout out my mom, shout out my sister, uh, Wavy, my, my my brother, Demod, my cousin, Cortez, my, my other bro that was in the video, Blair, check him out, he's an artist. Like, I want to shout everybody out. My my partner in Texas, the key, he, he's an artist, Whiskey, you know what I'm saying? So my end mode, and I can't forget, I can't forget my fucking, my sister, Malibu, Kylie, she holds me down. You know what I'm saying? Like, she holds me down. <laughs> yeah, siblings are definitely important. <laughs> they are. They hold it down. They hold it down for me. They hold it down for the kids. So, love. And this is also your worldwide video premiere. So can you please yes. introduce your video? This is my new music video for my single, Premonition. My name is Jody Mackay. Follow me on all social platforms. Check me out, y'all. Please, allow me to show you something. Just tell him it's a premonition. Niggas better pay attention. Man, see, like that shit, man. Oh. 
Uh, just tell him it's a premonition. Niggas be frontin' like I'm not the feeling. They say it's filled with competition. Give him the bill like my name must be Clinton. Might spend a week up in Britain. Axin' his posture to give me the linen. Get you the floss, but the tea never spinning. Just say to myself, I can post in your village. Uh, money bag, money bag, money bag, money bag, money bag. I need it all now. It could be called out. That product is so hard. There's no interference right now. My mind must be focused. I'm so braggadocious. I'm like Hocus Pocus. You bitches don't notice. I put the spell over my crown. Spartan, you niggas. I'm kicking you down. Just tell him it's a premonition. Niggas be frontin' like I'm not the feeling. They see me cooking in the kitchen. They wanted some sauce and that Creole be kicking. Niggas see it all in the vision. Cool out your red, but some time to be tenant. You niggas so capping, you bitches be in it. You buzzer be hating, return to the center. Uh, but let's see, I got sent to know for private shows. Even got a text once I hit the road. Never told no lies, I got different goals. You flexing on the gram like you got different hoes. Mayday, mayday, I get loose sleep for my payday. College roof for the printing, got been judging long with a straight face. Bag go on that flight with Medusa as my playmate. Cockapition, no juice to get you three rounds of that tri state. How you feeling? <laughs> How you feeling? How you feeling? <laughs> Just tell them it's a premonition. The wars are stacking, the money, the feeling. This heat is hitting kind of different. Sprinkle some bread for the frost and the pigeons. I be king like a machine. Howl at the moon like I was a teen. People be crisp. I like money green. Joy in my heart and those carrots go black. I can see it now. Flashing out. Cameras all in my grill. Trying to get the soup for my latest Achilles heel. I be bossed up. Tough fuck. No cross up. Big deal. Can't lose. Give a fuck on how you niggas feel, uh This ain't no regular shit You be fucking that degular bitch You be snooze, I'm in the news Catching a check on some technical shit You in a metal kick You might send us some secular pics She be taken, don't be mistaken Dick is so good and it can't be forsaken Sleep in my chain, fuck with the game Don't understand so they call me insane Got the new fit so I floss in the plane Gave her the dick and she called me by name What you don't understand, nigga I got the plan, I'm the go-getter Come back to the scene, you know it's mean Yeah, I get the looks like a magic bean Got the clothes lined up and the wine go dean Got the coupe laid back with some bitches scenes Like Galeano when I crash the spot Nigga, I get the bars every time I drop Another win for the game, gotta get that slot I'll be a tycoon, best believe I'll pop Huh? Aaron, that shit bad all right video today i hope you guys enjoyed that video but let's get right into our interview with tasha and boom video city take it away hey everybody it's tasha from video city tv and i'm here with booms from boston how are you doing i'm good how you doing tasha i'm tired but i'm doing well you know the snow is melting so exactly. i'm happy to go outside a little bit right right same here but I want to jump right into your music because your music video, Desserts, definitely caught my attention and kept it throughout the whole thing. So um, how okay. did you come up with the concept for the song? I mean, honestly, I came up with it with my team. Um, I mean, it really just started off with just having fun in the studio, just trying to create, you know, just a fun song. And then, you know, uh, the producer was just making a beat and then we just kind of formulated everything right there because uh, I'm vegan already. So we wanted to do a song where it was like, you know, usually vegans, they look at us, we only eat salad, but there's vegan dessert out there. So it was like, no, I like dessert too, you feel me? So, you know, just a, a quick, fun metaphor, you know, quick, fun song. And we was like, yeah, let's do it in the bakery. So we just, you know, just set up the plans right there. Was it a vegan bakery or just a plain regular bakery? They had both. They had, um, they had vegan and non-vegan stuff in it. Mm -hmm. Definitely. So you talked about cake in the song, but it's a video mm -hmm. that donut shop so i was a little confused with that one was right, that right. this or yeah i mean you know i didn't want to i didn't want to give away too much i didn't want to be too obvious with it so i try to do a different type of video you know i could have just put a, a lot of cake in the video you know but i was like i'll i'll go the subtle route with the dessert you know got some some donuts going you know some chocolate you know but you're not really sure what you know so right um, so I know one theme or one line of the song is when you said that you don't like bony women. I am small myself, so I was a little offended. So oh, what really? woman do you do you prefer? Oh no, see that when I think of bony, I think of like just like 
I think of, how can I say? First of all, I'm not trying to body shame anyone. <laughs> good. I have no problems, I have no problems with slim women. If you go uh-huh. eat, you know, you just gotta have a good personality, good head on your shoulders. I work with you. It ain't got nothing to do with none of that. But you feel me in in the song, I was kind of talking about just my admiration for thick women, honestly. Mm-hmm. And it just it went with the metaphor cake, you feel me? So you got that cake, you understand thickness, you know. So but there's all different types of booty, you know, this this small, you know. <laughs> It's big booty, you know, it's, it's whatever, you know. Mm-hmm. I don't discriminate. So what type of women do you prefer? You prefer someone that's, that that is bigger or smaller? What's your type? I mean, you heard the song. <laughs> yeah, you know. Yeah, I just, you heard the song, you know, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I mean, you know. Honestly, yeah, I think I think I prefer thick women right now. That's how I'm feeling right now, you know. I get it. Everyone, you know, everyone has mm-hmm, But I mean, stuff. shoot, you feel me? For, I mean, you've heard the fabulous song, Slim Thick. Right, that is very right. true. You know, so there's, there's different types. You know, I don't want to, I don't want to put a, uh, too much of a stamp on one thing, you know, because there's a lot out here, you know? Right, right. So how did you come up with your artist name? Uh, Pretty much, it was just in school, you know, that's when I first started rapping in high school, and, um, pretty much I just realized that I was different like just even the way I thought you know how you know in high school people are clickish you know they they like to you know stick with the popular crowd and all of that stuff but me I was I was someone who was cool with everyone you know I had everyone in school doing this move that and then pretty much that's where my name came from because you know I once I realized that I was different and I wanted to actually you know show people that I used to, I just switched I just switched the word smooth backwards called myself booms took off the E and then wow. had everyone doing a dap in school and it was just like you know just just really trying to do something different instead of just the status quo just you know and just being a follower mm-hmm. I know that there's a lot of artists coming out of Boston especially right now so what would you say sets you apart from everybody else I mean pretty much my versatility and I probably say my my willingness to speak on the hard topics that a lot of people are scared to touch like you know, we have a lot of songs that come out, you know, and it's a lot of party music, you know, but in, in, in a lot of times of like strife and and how can I say uh, uh, negativity, sometimes we need we need positive music that's going to uplift us to, you know, look at things in a in a in, introspective light. You know what I'm trying to say? Mm-hmm. So, you know, I try to make both types of music. So that's what I think sets me apart, that I try to make entertainment music that's fun, like, you know, songs like Dessert. Mm-hmm. But then I also have a song, you know, called Sole Del Gloria, where it's about, you know, just giving praise to the universe for, you know, being alive. So right. I have, you know, and I also have a song called Miss America about America. Yeah, I think and I that's talk about right. her like a woman. Mm-hmm. So what will your next project look like? I think you mentioned that briefly. Oh, yep, Sole Del Gloria too. So pretty much the, so the first Sole, it was more of a serious project where I was pretty much just trying to, trying to exhibit the fact that I, I had gained new resolve from my experiences in life. So mm-hmm. after that, Soleil 2 is where I'm having fun, you feel me? And I'm not I'm not caring about what people are saying and I'm just going in trying new things because I know I'm different. So I know that whatever comes out of me, it's not gonna come out of anyone else. Right. So, you know, it's just raw. So what does success look like for you? Like, what are some of your goals? Uh, for me? Uh, well, first, you know, I, I definitely wanna, you know, build my, my brand. Um, you know, I, I'm also looking into, you know, owning a business that has to do with um, agriculture. Mm-hmm. Um, so it's actually called Veggie Heaven. Um, so pretty much what I'm going to do, I'm still trying to work it out, but I'm trying to figure something out where I can pretty much sell people healthy food and just get them onto, you know, the the wave of, you know, eating healthy. Because that's the wave now, you know, people are learning and actually educating themselves on what's going on out here. And, you know, the way things should be done. So, you know, I just think that I want to be one of the people that's ushering in that new wave, you know, in the culture. Would you make a song that's, I guess, encouraging people to go vegan or to eat right? I don't think anyone's done that. Yeah, no, I've made a song because, you know, when you touch... When it comes to that, it's kind of hard to, you know, I don't want to tell people to go vegan, you know? I just want to tell people to care about their quality of life and to eat to live, you know what I mean? Like, I'd rather say that. Because, you know, you can't you can't tell somebody to do something. They ain't going to do it, you know? You got to, you know, people been eating meat their whole lives. That's all we knew. That's all I knew for 20-something years. So, you know, I, I, know, it's, I know it's hard. Right, you know, so. right. But, well, nah, definitely, I would make a song about that. That would be dope. I would want to see it. So if you do it, tag me, please. Oh, I got you. Don't worry. Definitely. Know um, that. But are there any shout outs you'd like to do? Uh, 
Um, yeah, definitely. Uh, you know, so on the song, I want to shout out Rock Sound. You know, they made the they made the beat. Uh, that's my peoples over there, at Rock Sound. Um, Lord Jew, she featured on the video. You know, she's a dope Boston artist from out here. Um, and so I want to shout out the video man, Spencer Seas. Definitely did his thing on that. He's um he's our video guy. He, he makes some fire. We got more heat coming out too soon, so we're definitely working. So I just want to give all the people who helped me make the video. You know, the bakery, everyone, just give them a shout out. Appreciate it. Yeah, where is that bakery? I'm kind of interested. Um, It is in, I believe it's in Santa Monica, California. Oh, it's in California. I thought yeah, it was we in, was in Cali with it. Stop playing. We was in Cali. Oh, okay. I see you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, that was my first time there, too. It was fun. Wow. How did you get that connection? You just showed up or you emailed or called? It was it was a lot of work, honestly. Uh, we had to we had to get some coordination with the video guy because he was actually already out there. So we just kind of was like, "Hey, man, see if you can find us something. You know, we'll kind of we'll kind of work it out." Mm-hmm. You know, so then okay. we just went down there. Well, thank you for coming on our show. And mm-hmm. if you'd like to introduce your video desserts. Okay. Hey, how's it going, everyone? My name's Wooms, and this is my video dessert. Yeah, she called it a monster. She got her cake dessert. Can't even bother. Yeah, 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 yeah. Push it in, push it in, push it in. Push it in, push it in. Yeah, yeah she call it a monster. She gotta have cake dessert. If not, I can't even bother. Push it in, push it in. Ay, yeah, I can't hit nothing bony. Ay, squeezing together them cheeks on my. Squeezing together them cheeks on my. I feel like I'm swimming in some motherfucking water. Petite, one booty like water. Yeah, make it pop like soda. Yeah, make it drop like currency. Yeah, I need a quarter. Over the knobs and the quarters. Hey, freaky little chocolate free. Bitches is calling my phone. No service, like I got an old motor roller. Says she ain't trying to be too freaky. Then girl, why you unleash the monster? She stupid, she want me to spoil her. She could get way too spooky for her. Something like Halloween. Bitches is playing around. Uh, don't got no time for trees. Don't uh, let you trick it, please. Uh, that's what she said to me. It's a lot of stacks back. Hey, got the bitch fuck with me. Nigga, I do what I said I'ma do. That's why she let me all in a G spot. She ain't believe that this shit could be done. Yeah, you a rusty nigga like your pops. She know Vizzy the one with the key. That's why she wanna give me the lot. You know you really ain't no shit. Nigga, you ain't even got a lot. Yeah, she call it a monster. She gotta have cake dessert. If not, I can't even bother. Pushing it. Hey, yeah, I can't hit nothing bony. Hey, squeezing together them cheeks on my Squeezing together them cheeks on my I feel like I'm swimming in some motherfucking water Petite, one booty like water Yeah, make it pop like soda Yeah, make it drop like currency Yeah, I need a quarter Over the dimes and the quarters Hey, freaky little chocolate free <laughs> Bitches is calling my phone No service like I got a old motor roller He got the whole end of conda I call him daddy, he call me mommy Come over, let's make a daughter I know he feeling my aura I got the juice, I'm a charger If he start lying if he start cheating, I'ma just fuck on his father I'm a savage, I'm a monster Fucking bitches like Blanca I got the drop, I got the plot Taking his soul when I touch his G-spot Ooh. Freaky little chocolate freak He coming over, I'm making him ski Not on his face, then I'm going to sleep Capiche, his tongue going swimming in me Ooh. Yeah, she call it a monster She gotta have cake dessert If not, I can't even bother Pushing it, Hey, Yeah, I can't hit nothing bony Hey, squeezing together them cheeks on my Squeezing together them cheeks on my I feel like I'm swimming in some motherfucking water Petite, one booty like water Yeah, make it pop like soda Yeah, make it drop like currency Yeah, I need a quarter Over the knobs and the quarters Hey, freaky little chocolate free Bitches is calling my phone No service like I got a old motor roller all right, video Steve, let's get right back into our countdown. We have Kenson Guapo from Fort Myers, Florida with No Sucker. He's definitely No Sucker. Take a look at this video. And shout out to Skip. Video City, take it away. Hey, uh, no, I ain't no buster. No, I ain't no buster. Guap nigga. Stop pot shit. D major, baby. No, I ain't no buster. No, I ain't no buster. No, I ain't no, uh, uh. no, I ain't no sucker. Wapo. No, I ain't no sucker. No, I ain't no buster. I'ma pull up at your nigga. I'ma fucking bust you. I'ma crack a nigga melon better than I fuck with you. I get money every day. You get a buck fifty. Catch your app at the light. Empty the whole fifty. Take a flight to the island just to hide out. Cause right now, nigga dealing with a mosh pit. We hit the block, we getting money on some flash shit. Real step and step on niggas, that's a mosh pit. If you got a problem, pull up, I never mind it. And my bitch, you got a ass, I tell her ride it. 
I'm a zoo, so you know a nigga zoo with it. No, I ain't no sucker. No, I ain't no buster. I'ma pull up at your nigga. I'ma fucking bust you. I'ma crack a nigga, melon better not fuck with me. I get money every day, you get a buck fifty. Catch your app at the light, empty the whole fifty. Take a flight to the island just to hide out. Cause right now, nigga dealing with a match fit. Yeah, it's guapo and it's diddy, gon' respect it. I hit the block, I roll a zip, my nigga match it. We from the block, so them hoes be getting ratchet. They in the club, be popping pussy for them broke niggas. Yeah, it's guapo in the club, he in the vip, nigga. I stop fresh with them, I shot you stealth, nigga. If you raise your voice, I mean you getting stressed, nigga. Zang shit, when we pull up, we let it out. Fully automatic in that bitch, who hung around? No, I ain't no sucker, no, I ain't no buster. I'ma pull up at you, nigga, I'ma fucking bust you. I'ma crack a nigga, melon better not fuck with me. I get money. Money every day, you get a buck fifty. Catch your app at the lock, empty the whole fifty. Take a flight to the island just to hide out. Cause right now, nigga, dealing with a match fit. We hit the block, we getting money on some flash shit. Alright, Video City, we're gonna take it to Raleigh, North Carolina. We have Ant Eggers with the Battle Down. Video City, take it away. going on man can't believe they burnt grandma's house down man it's crazy man hey we is the same no we is no different but going through changes made me so different Since back in the day, I knew I had to create and be prolific Well, no choice but for me to go get it Though I'm grown now, I remember when I was just a child Around the age of six, Hey, Didn't have much, but I was thankful for everything that I get And I was proud of everything that I did But you knew we had to move, cause this wasn't the move Living in a shot, I would cry while attending school Everybody thought I wasn't cool enough to hang with the other girls and dudes And I was just far from the truth, being little You really don't know the difference between being ignorant and being indifferent Probably the reason why my confidence diminished I was mentally finished for a moment in time Thinking life was a riddle Always caught in the middle Or so it seemed Not realizing that life is actually simple It's all in the mental Hey, okay It's all in the mental And I'm just realizing now That I was singled out as a child Cause I'm a different type of individual And I'm never thinking generic or simple I vividly remember the morning My mama told me it was time to go back Hey, she said it was time to go back Hey, Said it was time to go back Cause North Carolina is where home was at Hey, 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 okay Cause it was time for a fresh start Moved in with grandma And from there, hey, I knew I would go far Hey, okay With that dad, I'm gone I'm gonna make it with that dad City. Thank you so much for tuning in with me, your girl, where you guys know where to find me and follow me. Don't forget to check us out on YouTube and don't forget to wear a mask. Remember, we're number one because the street says so. Video City, take it away. <laughs>